Okay, so now you're going to do that a second time. So we're gonna use the polygon tool again, single click in your art space. Your settings should be saved, but if they're not, it's 350 PX and your sides should be set to three and then click okay. It'll make a second triangle. Then you can use your move tool to drag it and spin it, rotate it so the point is facing down and then align it inside the larger circle that you already created. Make sure it's lined up perfectly. You want these edges to be touching. If you need to tweak a little bit, you can zoom in, move that shape up. Just make sure everything is touching and aligned. So you have no holes and no gaps. Command zero will snap your screen back to full screen. Um, once you've done this, click Command S to save and because you've already named it once. Um, if the option comes up to save on your computer, click save on your computer, save it in your folder. Um, that's your graphic design folder, which is either on your desktop or in your documents. Once you've done this, you're going to use your move tool again, make sure that's selected. Use the shortcut Command A to select all. Then you're going to copy Command C and paste it in Photoshop. So we're gonna go back over to Photoshop and you're going to, I already pasted it, I'm gonna get rid of that. Once you're in Photoshop and you have your um, photograph pulled up, you're going to Command V to paste. Make sure Pixels is chosen, click OK. Then you can resize your illustrator lines to fill much of your, uh, as much of your photograph as possible. Don't bring it completely edge to edge. Give it some breathing room. And when you're resizing, make sure you're holding the shift key. You can use your arrows to nudge if you need to. Once you've had, once you've resized it, click the return key or tap the return key and then command S to save your file. Again, you don't need to do save as here because you've already saved it and you've already named it. Once you're done with this step, make sure everything's saved and then you can move on to the next step.